Welcome to 5 Minute School and in today's video we're going to be talking about the pituitary gland and uh, in today's video I just want to focus on the hormones which are produced by the anterior and posterior pituitary and uh, I'm going to focus on the next few videos on its hypothalamic control. So uh, we have the pitu pituitary gland located here in this diagram you can see it's uh, highlighted in red here we have the posterior lobe and here we have the anterior lobe and I think in separate videos I'll talk about the anatomy of them both but in this video I'm just going to focus on the hormones that are produced so the posterior pituitary has um, well it stores and releases hormones produced by the hypothalamus and in the anterior pituitary it produces and secretes its own hormones and it's regulated by hormones secreted by the hypothalamus so um, we have these trophic hormones here which are secreted by the anterior pituitary so we'll talk about that first we have growth hormone which promotes the movement of amino acids into cells and incorporation of these amino acids into proteins it also promotes overall tissue and organ growth and growth of cartilage and bone we also have a uh, thyroid stimulating hormone produced by the anterior pituitary and it stimulates the thyroid gland to produce and secrete t4 and t3 which we'll talk about in a separate video as well we also have adrenocorticotropic hormone and it stimulates the adrenal cortex to secrete uh, glucocorticoids like cortisol we have follicle stimulating hormone which sim stimulates the growth of ovarian follicles in females and the production of sperm in males we have luteinizing hormone which is also produced and in females it stimulates ovulation and conversion of ovulated ovarian follicle into corpus luteum and in males it stimulates testosterone production from Leydig cells in the testes and lastly we have prolactin and in females that stimulates milk production in the mammary glands now the posterior pituitary gland um, releases the following two hormones it's antidiuretic hormone and that's responsible for water retention by the kidneys I've made a separate video on that and also oxytocin which stimulates the contractions of the uterus during labor okay that's everything I want to discuss just regarding the hormones of the pituitary gland thank you very much for watching